Isla's okay. She's sleeping now. She'll need some time to fully recover. Thank you again, Mr. Crane. My wife Jasmine should be back any time now, and since I know how tiring these kids can be, I'm sure you'll be wanting to move on. No, not just yet. But, well, our supplies are very limited. Look, this is too much responsibility for one person, Rupert. I've sent for help. They'll be here soon. That's not necessary. Jasmine and I can handle things just fine. Rupert, I was downstairs. Oh, I see. I'm, I'm sorry, Rupert. Sometimes in those noises, I think I can still hear a tiny trace of her voice. I was hoping it would be over by now, but I couldn't do it. My wife, my beautiful, beautiful Jasmine. This has to end. I would let her kill me before I would lift a finger to harm her. Just give me the basement key. Someplace safe. Do it now. Did you find her? Were you able to help her? She has peace now. Thank you. From both of us. I hope somewhere I may find forgiveness for what I did. For what I... couldn't do. I'm afraid I have to, sweetie. But some friends are coming to help you guys out. 
They'll be here really soon. What if the troll gets them? Uh, what troll? There's a giant troll down in the parking lot. He makes lots of very scary noises, so it's hard to sleep. Oh, well, that's no good. No, sir. Clear out here. Oh, of course it is. Scratch one troll. Crane, this is Rupert. You're all right? Yeah, but kids are a lot more work than I realized. That's the truth. Look, your friends arrived, so I'm turning in my wizard hat and headed back to my workshop. I want you to meet me there. I owe you one. I'm willing to pay it. I'll meet you there. 